having problems and you want to make an incredible box mod? Well, don't worry. This is the perfect series for you. This is today the second part of how to make Jason and how to do some sprites. And if you want to make designs, you can go to the first part. It will it will help you. First, we need to make a sprite. The sprite and the sprite sheet, the kit is on under the description. So that will help you. To make a sprite sheet, you gotta go to the files. I, and there's like a, there's like, you gotta search like, what, like something like small. For the small sprite, I recommend using small and even medium and large it depends on what how many heads do you have like how many polos animation you need like if it's there's a lot you pick large if there's like a small it's like there's like a medium amount you pick me you medium if there's like a little amount you can choose small choose choose small guys like recommendation there's actually more though but these are the these are the average ones so yeah so that's why before you do this just use this after you finish the thing you because that's really important for jason because yeah hold on i'm gonna find the polo yeah i'm blowing this shit so do it for uh for uh spoil for not spoiling the mod so yeah so pick this and uh it's just you pick the hold on okay no i don't don't merge the head together so grab the glasses if you don't have any glasses that is unnecessary so yeah you can just use the head i mean if there's no like no mask you can just use it normally you could just use the body lung yeah i why you say the philippines long. So who cares so put the head on the right side it doesn't matter it always matter it always matter if it's finished so you gotta put the head and yeah and then copy paste on them how the hell do I know without using up without using up the see? It's because I can tell by their head. I can tell by their I I am I am the sprite master now really. I, I don't even know how to animate a mouth so so if how do I know this? So it's I just put this. So I just just fucking goes left so I can know what thing they so copy this and then uh unmerge I merge them back because this is really important for later and just move them at the more at the most perfect time and you already did it I already did it for like one job I still got the skills to pay the bills baby so you remove the head if there's like more out it's not it's unnecessary it just depends on how many heads you got if there's like one spot that that is empty just remove it just yeah so now it's time to copy this simple ass body I just made this is for the last time tutorial. Yeah, it looks not bad. So it's like a simple last pull. So you put this. You put this on this thing. So you know, hold up. So you put this and uh, then put this thing, and then you got it. You got the head. And then copy paste this thing. If you are struggling and don't know what is going on, if you're confused, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna unmerge this thing. So hold up. So invert the body invert the normal sprite so you can tell and you can see the white spot and if you see the white spot just cover them up nobody's gonna know that so yeah also remove also re also if you see like a small tiny amount of of, uh, of a white of a white line it doesn't matter because it's just a sp it's just a spot it won't it won't it won't just broke down it won't break it won't break actually so if you do this at the same strategy this is the strategy how i make my sprite i just use the invert connected and yeah if just try to do the same thing like the white line and see they're perfect and then here's the hard part it's time to do something interesting before so hold up before we're gonna do that i'm gonna copy the head that thing in and then unmerge that shit again because that i don't know why because i think i use those late for later so yeah and just put this thing above and put it like the same thing if you're st and yeah if you're still struggling and don't know what if you don't know what if it's real if you actually do it invert the normal sprite again and you see a white spot in his head so put that above and she she looks clean so yeah and then invert them and, and here comes the real part putting the mouth Okay, for the head, for the head animation, go to the files and search Polo Face without a space actually. So, uh, I, I don't recommend it. I, I, just, 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 just search above. Just search face. Just search face, and you'll find the Polo Face file. 
and there's uh, yeah there's like a, a full kit about this but these are the small amount so i so this is for the beginner this is a beginner mouth one so if you're making a trumpet there's not gonna be a trumpet if you're making whistle there's like uh there's like some whistle this whistle just like two whistle but it's not that whistly too much but yeah and also just invert the sprite again so if you want it move so shabow sheesh you see that just checking it so it's time to add the fucking blow it's time to blow that up so it's time to find the big puff so like a big mouth it just goes poof. so it just yeah it just yeah it's uh it's yep it's this one so yeah yeah if you're struggling you can find it you can find it there's like a there's like there's like a small image you can find them easily also link on the kit for the description there's gonna be more than this one so there's gonna be more than this kind of small stuff so i'm sending you a big fat file about this bowl of faces so and i'm gonna find the small one like the little puff like this one uh, put a bit of the money shit what am i talking about money what am i oh my whisker crabs so put this stick and go back a little bit and you actually hold on hold on yeah we done yeah if you want yeah you can do like eyebrow animation yeah you can do eyebrows like eye animation but yeah that shit it would take forever that's why i'm lazy that's why i'm barely that's why i do i that's why that's why most of my that's why all my mojas has have like masks so i don't want to fucking do the the fucking eyes and the eyebrow animation they fucking they fucking sucks that's why i'm lazy as hell. so if you want to do like head animation uh, you can actually do those. So if, you, if yeah, cause there's like a uh, eye hole in the in the polo face in the description. So yeah, if you're actually struggling, hold on. If you are done now and use this thing, you pick the color balance to make it dark. So before I'm gonna talk about the how the hell it works, you just save it and you're done. Oh yeah, I was about to talk about the eyebrows and and uh eye animation it's not it's not that hard but it's really uh, time consuming so yeah it adds just like more time but yeah if you can do those if you want to be lazy like me i like a mask yeah of course yeah you can do like eyebrow animation to speak the eyes because the eyes would take forever so if you want to do stuff like those so you can actually just put the eyes on the right on the fucking right side do like not do like inverted you can still do that it's so time consuming i can i don't know how to to do those things but yeah i can do eyebrows but eye animation i suck at it i can do eyebrows but but they actually they fucking they fucking give me so much time so i yeah uh, i know i know why so for the next month i'll fucking add like add anim eye animation soon so yeah but there's like some most of them are gonna be masks but maybe some maybe actually some of them will have masks but who cares anyways it's time to get to resizing them all right next one is gonna do resizing them so it depends on my polos i'll give you a big fat screen about it then here we go go to fast and find your sprite just go to the pictures if there's not just go there and pick the pictures and click the sprite you need to find and then you gotta go size it with six weeks one with on with percent aspect ratio so it will help much easier because 661 10 54 is the png size those are really important so times to do the json how it work is when the coding animation is something new this is why numbers thing is important when coding because it's the reason to make animation to make animation is like numbers of animation example like water coding from flood skip to flip a clip and scratch Yes, I know, some people think making animation in Incredibox is pointless, but it gives you a cool feeling over the animation and appreciate the art when behind the scenes of making mods. Imagine ever there, Codebox, Travis, and Beta, etc. with no animation. Yeah, boring and feel empty, am I right? But yeah, there's no, s yeah, there's sounds, but yeah, it's just, it's like watching some dude without saying, without moving a mouth or no body animation just looks empty am i actually the sprite right sheet of the numbers how it works i'll explain it left to right i'll use everdar sprite as an example 0 164 328 492 656 820 980 1140 and i'll explain it top to middle is 380 638 and 880 
but if you want to make a head animation there's this thing from y axis and x axis you can see it right here right now so yeah I'll explain how they work so translation x without negatives goes to the right with with negatives it goes to the left and for the up and downs y negative it goes to the up there you go and without the negative goes to the down so i hope that explains a lot to make an animation goes to a full edit because it's really useless or you can use a code because yeah you know a code is really for the coding but i rather use full edit because it saves a lot of time instead of downloading another app but yeah so go to your files if you, you go to your files that you place for the sprite that you made so example hold up example for uh, where the fuck is it man hold up right there you go download and project 2 that's like where i placed it so so we got the big size on the hd and for the small size we done for the png size so yeah yeah the reason why png and hd are really important so yeah oh oh my lord <laughs> Right, so put some numbers like 164, 164. Hold on, I'm gonna zoom it for you. Ignore the green bar on the right, cause it just happens to me all the time. So, so put them 3 to 8, 3 to 8 for the blow puff. 164 is the the holding puff, like the the blow puff. So in the 3 to 8 is just a let it go mouth. So yeah, here's some stuff. I, I, I don't know, I'm not gonna show you. I don't know why I'm still doing this. Time. So negative four is for the going up. So seven is gonna go down. So six six five four that's that's how you make a really smooth animation you, you just you don't you don't need like choppy stuff but yeah you can do choppy stuff but these are how i made my uh my smooth animation so i will paste them up all right so i just copy paste the stuff so yeah i just go down copy paste the beat if you're making like a just repeats all the time you know like that you can do that so if there's like patterns don't do don't do this bro just try your best to match the beat so it's like it's it's like doing flip a clip it's like making a flip up click animation without hearing the sound which i know that sucks but yes still so it's yeah this is why that coding is a different as story than making sprites because you gotta do a lot of number work you gotta find the perfect stuff if especially for loop 2 for second loop it's animation because second loop animation are really hard so you, you gotta be a, like a pro mod maker to do those now you, i'm not even pro mod maker yet i'm just i'm just a normal pro mod maker i'm just i'm just like a a um i don't know a, a veteran i'm not veteran but i'm like i'm a normal mod maker guy so i i actually know a lot of things but i but if we make another one all right well I'll copy paste this thing hold up so yeah you gotta add like add numbers if you want no head animation that's fine you can do like if you want to make a demo you, it's fine you not add like a uh, thing so always remember remove the last coma remove the last coma on the last on the last sprite on the last json whatever that shit called so it's always remove it because if not the game won't work because if you do that yes that will be bad so awful i forgot to explain so these are for how they work so loop time it's for the how many seconds of the sound are there like example if they're like seven seconds put like seven seven thousand or something so yeah for turtle plane this is for how speed it is like the frame rate for that so yeah hold on i'll explain you a bit more clear tap json are really important for the incredible box that's that's the backbone for making it so yeah also i forgot to mention the more longer the sound it is the more slow your total frame so if if it's like 12 seconds i i put it like 55 90 sec 590 for the total frame so yeah once you're done making app, press this funny looking wrench buttons to install the app so yeah so wait for the steps to finish and then press the uninstall and then press install you just have to wait when the uh, app is uninstalled now now wait for the app to load and then press install just don't worry it's gonna take a while i'm gonna speed this shit up <laughs> Alright, there we go. So press open or you just press done if you don't want to play the app yet. So, yeah. So we're at the app now. So we gotta wait and push the version. There you go. And we gotta wait this shit to load. If it stops, that means there's something wrong in your JSON. Alright, we're at the app. So we have place. So ignore the icon stats for my JSON maker. So if it looks fast, you could, you could change the total frame you want. Because, yeah, if you want something smoother like this guy on the left, 
yeah look at this shit bro look at this shit bro yeah 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 if you want something smoother it's, it's because it's because i put it on the on the right amount the perfect time the perfect frame rate for the polo so yeah if it looks too fast just change the total frame so i hope this helps for you so yeah anyways thank you so much for watching this video because this video was literally a campaign in the ass so yeah anyways next part i'll do the sound so bye